right, so Eric and I have been we've been trying to come to the same spot. Oh, mosquitoes everywhere. We've been trying to come to the same spot, but there's keep being there's keep water on the road. So what happens is the tide level comes up and it comes through the sand, and then we get all this water on the road like that, and um, we're not willing to drive our, our vehicles through through salt water. Yeah. So <laughs> it your brakes up. It makes it messes your brakes up. So this is literally like Plan B. Are we wearing the Again. same shirt? No. No. This is literally like Plan B. The second time that we try to come out here, nuts. I mean, it's it's not too bad as far as water on the road, but it's bad if you if salt water. So we don't want to mess with salt water. So yeah, we're gonna go to Plan B. We're gonna we're still gonna put our wagers on. Yes, sir. But we're gonna we're gonna go. We can get at it. We're gonna make it happen. We're gonna go get some flatties. We're going. We're not you know deterred. We're gonna keep going and jump back in the truck and run down the road. Thanks for coming back. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, share. Eric said he hey, has the first one. Just bit it, right? Yep, he got it now. Oh, dang! The mosquito went on your eyeball. First one of the Look day. Look at that. Right underneath the lip, too. Under, under the jaw. First one of the day. Mosquitoes all over us. Dang. I'm gonna be fighting this one. Right up under the lip. Perfect right action. Perfect. God dang it. But it's crazy how I could tell he didn't have that hook. Yeah. He probably just laid on it. I bumped it, bumped it, bumped I think it. You just had the tail. Oh, I see what you're saying. I can feel it when that, that metal hit it. Got to watch out for that boat that came last time. You got one? Uh -uh. I don't think so. Just uh, coming up that slope? I do got one. You do have one? I just suddenly bite it. Oh, there you go. Eric with his second of the day. Oh, another small one. Which is kind of concerning because we already got a lot of casting already. This is my goat. I see that. He threaded it. We got a lot of casting already and we're not really, we haven't really seen them just yet. Yeah, little thing. Got this one the smallest of the year. Small. <laughs> little, little one. Oh, there you go. I'm messing with you. Come pick it up. Nope. Rubbing on a damn rock. Is it a flatty? That's something. Nope. Yeah. It was on the other side of the hang up. Nah, it was on oh. the other side of the hang up. I could feel the rock that it was on. Yeah. Like he was just on the other side of it. First of the day. First of the day, flatty, flat itis. You got one? Yeah, Eric got one. I just got this little guy. Eric has a good one, he said. I just say you bit funny. Oh. There you go. Double mint brothers. Mm. Cheers. Mm -hmm. Is he on there, bro? Is he on there, little guy? Little, little, little guy, huh? Oh yeah, there he goes. Oh man, he's a chip ahoy. He is a little one. Look at that. I need, like I I, oh, he came up. All you need is some salsa. Yeah. And we're good to go. For real. Is this a fish or what, man? Get him. It won't bite it. I don't know. Take what it. it is. Take it. Set that hook. See, there you go. Hook set to free. I told you. You don't need to wait. It's a good one. Well, you don't need to wait. No, it felt like I was working it through mud again. <clears throat> so soft today ground so soft it must have got a little warmer the last couple days and the fish got smaller and the fish got smaller the I catch 18 the yesterday <laughs> there you little, go. Guy. little guy little guy so, uh, oh there we go fish. oh no it don't look small unless you foul hook them no nah, ain't foul that's my way it's splashing good Came up, hit that surface. There he goes. Oh yeah, he's not happy with you. Well, lay it down for me. Hold him up. Hold him up. Nice thick one. Ooh, look at all. Look at that belly. Ooh, we. Golly, that's a big. One. Let's see that mud on the bottom side. Dang, look at that belly. <laughs> oh, that's some kind of tumor. <laughs> a minor tumor. That boy eating good. 
Oh, watch out. Watch your line. Ugh. Is this a fish? Is this a, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Is this a fish? This might be a little fish. There we go, little one. Go? Little guy. I've been working him. Oh, he got a little weight to him. Can't have that copyright infraction in my video. There we go. Woo! You get one too? Oh, Eric, Eric lick me. Eric lick the pot. Look at him. Look at this guy right here licking the pot. Hey, Ruben, you got your fish there. Don't let me see if there's another one there for you. And then and then he tried to argue with me and say he has fish etiquette today. I do. What? <laughs> Look at that. Oh my gosh, you got my screen wet. Baby, baby. Let's uh, double up. Double mint sisters. Look at this nice Dan Cole no, uh, net, net, nice new net I got here. There we go. Easy dozer. Look, look, look. It's a, it's a Danko reunion. You know, hold your pliers up. Danko, Danko. Fishy. Danko, yes, Danko. Sir. Got to get the ones that work. Got to get the ones that work. Well, Eric just got a, a hole in his waders. He tripped on some of the structure out here and, and ripped a hole in his waders. But you know, it is so slow. It is, so he, he left, but it is so slow out here. I'm gonna, I might have to uh, throw a quick audible, another one. But I'm gonna fish a, little, fish a little more, fish on this side. See, Flounder like structure, and this is like one of the main highways where they leave out. So they come in here and they'll bump their nose all around the structure and fit and, and, and feed and then and just keep moving as they migrate off. So I'm gonna fish here just a little bit more. Uh, probably go to the other side and fish the other side. There's Eric way over there leaving. But um, yeah, I'm gonna fish here just a little more. Uh, give it a little more time. It's still kind of early. And then, uh, you know, just, I gotta, I gotta find them. I'm gonna find them. Spend a few hours this morning fishing. A few more hours fishing, so. See if I can find a few more, you know, cause I only caught a couple. Oh, that's a good one. Right in front of me too. Right in front of me. Yeah, I was going to the other side. I was on my way out. Fishing over here. I got this nice one, real thick too. Right in front of me. And she just hit it. Hit it hard. Boy, she is thick. I can barely get a good grip on her. Come on, girl. Roll over. There we go. She is thick. Look how, look how thick she is. I hope you can tell. Sometimes these this camera doesn't do it justice. Big girl, thick girl though. Big old thick girl. Right back down in that in that net. Get tender. Get her off. There we go. Big girl. She is gone. Whew. <laughs> that saved this spot, I think. <laughs> you know, sometimes when the fish aren't cooperating, you always second get yourself. Should I not have come over here? But she had close to 18, I think. But she was thick. Oh my gosh, she was heavy. Very heavy girl. Man.
That's hilarious. I just side cast that one. He came up and he came up real fast. And I threw it right on him. Well, guys, that is going to do it today. You know, the <laughs> just one of those things, you know, the, the day didn't go as planned. I wanted to get into a, a new location in Whitefish. I, I weighed fished here in the past, and uh, the last year, weight fishing weight fishing there wasn't wasn't there it was it was a miss i've weight fished it four times during the flannel run and came up with zeros and then uh, the year before that we were stepping on them so i wanted to go back this year and i wanted to go weight fish that area but you know we had salt water on the road and i, I wasn't going to drive to that you know you miss up your brakes you miss up other stuff i, I wasn't going to drive to any salt water so i i opted to come over here and uh and weight fish the ferry landing and it was slow, you know, it was slow. Then I came over here and, and fished off the rocks a little bit. And it was slow, just slow. You know, we had a very big tide push uh, that went out. And the water level was very low. And the tide is starting to turn around and come back in now. It's about 1230 and the tide's coming back in now. So this afternoon, probably going to be really good. This afternoon's probably going to be really good. We're close to an, a full moon last night so you know that that always slows up the morning bite and you have more afternoon bite and then whenever you're fishing for flounder and you have that outgoing tide the flounder fill the pool and and they'll go a little deeper and that's what we're experiencing and probably a, if i could cast or fish more of a deep hole or more of the drop of the channel it's probably where they're all stacked up so as a as the tide starts coming back in the flounder fill that that push them to come back in and then they'll come back in the bank and they're probably loaded overnight uh, whenever we are experienced high tide so but hey you know that's part fishing i knew it was gonna be a challenge i knew it was gonna be a grind today with it being close to a full moon but i wanted to get out i wanted to fish um uh, got a chance to fish with my buddy eric and he had a hole in his he got a hole in his waders poor guy so he has to get online and buy him some new waders but um thanks for watching don't forget to subscribe to the channel and if you're interested in becoming a patron become a patreon today um i i'm gonna put this as soon as i get home i'm gonna put a fishing report up so people my patreons know what is going on in the water and and what what's going on where am i fishing what's the experience what's the weather they get all that information on patreon if not the same day then the next day well you guys probably get like anywhere from three to sometimes even seven days if i really get stacked up on videos but typically around three to five days so if you want to become a patron there's a link in the description join patreon today don't forget to check out waterland sunglasses save some money use the texas all water fishing fish code on that and uh yeah Thanks for coming back. Hopefully next time you catch me. Okay.